everyone welcome back to my channel today I have a very fun fixer-upper and it's just a really dingy uh, rundown apartment and this is in the spice district it's one of the cheaper apartments and when you first step to the right when you first walk in the door it's the bathroom I like the floor in the bathroom but it's just really small and the bedroom is small as well I mean it's a really small apartment in general and there's not really much going on some dirty clothes <laughs> so then we step back out into the living room and the living room and kitchen are together like there's not really any distinction it's just kind of all together and we do have a super huge large master bedroom but it has a little bit too much going on in here like it's the bedroom and it's the you can walk off onto the deck it has a desk inside and unfortunately when I was doing the speed build I completely forgot about this awesome deck so yeah I didn't actually remember until I was doing the voiceover and I wish I did remember because I had a few plans for that but um I kind of was wanting to use like every time I do a build I always go for the new basketball flooring and I try not to but I know it's because it's new I just I like the shine that it gives and so far I've used the like the darkest color that's like the dark dark deep mahogany almost black and then the whitewashed one and I just kind of wanted to go with something else and the color that I chose was the it wasn't the orange it was like the red cherry color and once I laid it all down I decided it kind of had like a rich look to it like cherry wood like cherry wood finished furniture so I kind of went with that idea and I really wanted like in one of my previous builds I did like um, a bedroom off of the living room and it was like enclosed by like a windowed wall and I was thinking that would be like a really cool idea like because this apartment is so small and if I was to do an office like that but kind of make the windows a little more open and add the extra wall as a window as well and I've never used these doors and I really liked them and as I was building I was picturing like a businessman like a really wealthy businessman I have no idea why he would be living in the cheap apartment but I mean real estate <laughs> you work with what you have and it's a cheaper like if you can get a really nice look like this in a cheaper apartment I say hey why not <laughs> so I really like how it turned out I love the office I haven't done one like this but I was picturing this like political businessman because I think that's the sim that I'm gonna put into here is like just a bachelor and um, so I kind of made it have like the two chairs around the desk so that like if he had any appointments or any just meetings he had like a separate area even with the apartment being so small it still had like the professional I know what I'm doing look I think it turned out really well and it did stay in with like the classy rich look I kept with like the dark emerald green walls and just kind of kept with the building theme of the brick and I like using the brick for accent walls it just kind of helps add a little bit of character and because the apartments are brick it just kind of makes it look like it's part of the building and I really really like it how it turned out and I kind of had a bit of trouble trying to figure out how I wanted to do the living room because there wasn't really like a full wall like to put a TV on and because like one of the walls has the window and the other wall has doors the other is full windows and then behind the large coach there is no wall so that was a bit of a challenge but I do like in the end how it turned out I kind of changed things around a bunch of times but I do really like how I ended up doing that and if you guys like watching these kind of fixer uppers uh, make sure you give it a thumbs up so I know I really like to know what you guys like to see because that's definitely something I want to make more of and definitely let me know if you prefer just the plain music or not plain music because some of it's pretty good but if you would prefer just the music as you watch the build um, complete or if you would rather have me chit chat throughout um, it's completely up to you guys it makes no difference to me I like doing either or I really like doing the chit chat because just kind of makes me feel a little closer to you guys I can just kind of ramble 
and so yeah so I couldn't completely figure out what kind of curtain I wanted there originally I did have that like green um, patterned one but I found it was a little bit too like um kind of like a teenager would have in their room like it's a I love the curtain it's beautiful but for this it just seemed too um not childish just I don't know <laughs> for like a younger room it just didn't work well and the covers I just kind of kept like all the accent furniture I kept in the like really super dark browns like blacks and browns and just to kind of I wanted like a general theme throughout the whole entire apartment that's kind of the way I would do things like whatever kind of theme that I have I do that completely through the whole entire apartment I really like how it just flows that way and I really like having the lights under the cupboards that's not something I've ever done before not that it's like um, anything amazing <laughs> I just really like how it turned out and I just kind of kept the kitchen in the same layout that it was also because it is such a small um, apartment it just kind of worked well so just kind of revamped that a bit and added some uh, brick behind just for a little bit more of like a texture and just kind of adding a little bit of um, globes I seen them that's the thing like when you're building and you think you're done with the room and then you kind of see a few other knickknacks and you keep going back so I really like the little tiny um, table and chairs I mean he is a single man living in the apartment so he doesn't really need much and I didn't want to do like an island in this apartment like with the um, stools and stuff like that I found it it just for this apartment it didn't work with what I was going for and then I added in ended up adding in this kind of like divider wall and I think it was awesome I usually try not to do stuff like that because well within the um, smaller apartments because sometimes it can like really just kind of shrink the apartment but in this particular one I find it just kind of added so much more to the apartment like you could put um, the art like he is like a wealthy businessman so he really appreciates um very like uh expensive art and they're lit up really well so they can be seen but they are very big statement pieces and i think that wall turned out really well i just like it because it kind of gave a little bit of shape to the apartment instead of it just kind of being all as one and i really wanted to kind of put the bar in here but it didn't really work out it didn't look that great with the chess table and I really wanted the chess table more than the bar because number one for lo logic for his career because um, that's definitely a must <laughs> and I found a chess table just kind of looked really appropriate in the apartment just kind of going with the theme and I like that little corner nook I like how it turned out it's just kind of like a statement piece all in its own like if you were to just take a picture I think it looks really cute and the entrance way I just kind of kept it simple and I never really want to box in like the pipes and things like that because if they ever break or get leaky you're just gonna have to knock them out anyway so and I just kind of wanted to enclose the tub just to kind of um, I didn't really I don't like just shoving things up against the walls but um, and I like the two sinks even though there is only one he may someday have a missus move in I'm not too sure but I really like the bathroom just generally how it looks and flowers I put or not yeah flowers greenery I kind of put that throughout the home because it's just always nice to have a little something and it's a proven fact that um, greenery like flowers and things like that they help reduce the pollution in the air so not that that really matters in the sims but <laughs> I just always tend to go to those I really like it and it's a good space filler too so originally I had these floors picked out for the bedroom because I kind of wanted to do something a little different in like the um, bathroom and bedroom for like the flooring but I didn't really like it it just kind of contract like kind of didn't flow well and I like it just to kind of flow perfectly so I ended up changing the flooring as you'll eventually see and I find that picture it was really similar to like the one he had 
in his office behind his desk and it just kind of reminded me of like a self-portrait like he's just kind of very egotistical because you know he's he's a very wealthy man he's very successful but that also brought on a very big ego unfortunately but so he does have like pictures of himself but it does look really cute and then I did do this little closet and did the same door that like um castle like door I think it's really cute just for a little closet not that they actually use it but and just a little table and plant and oh, I wish so bad <laughs> that I remembered that the deck was there because I had like a whole little idea to do it there but oh well it's still there and it's it's kind of cute like it didn't really need a whole lot of work so that's pretty much it we're gonna head into the before and after pictures I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this because it's one of my favorite builds that I did. I've been really trying to branch out and get away from like the pinks and girly kind of themes because it's that's usually what I go to. So these have been just kind of really fun to do and they're some of my favorites actually. And I thought there was actually an ottoman somewhere. I couldn't find it. I don't know why. So I'm going to go ahead and let you enjoy the before and after pictures. Make sure you give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video so I know and subscribe so you don't miss any of my future videos. Bye guys! When your heart's bleeding and all you can see is red Till you discover it is within each other to forgive and make amends If I had known then or what I know now I wouldn't have said what I said I took the long road, thought I'd be better on my own Sometimes what's right is wrong instead Cause I